In our spirituality, it's not so much what we profess, it's how we live that makes the difference. It's how we walk the talk. It's how we do what we say that others should do. It is about living totally in the now moment with a feeling and a knowing that God is with us. And because of that feeling and knowing that God is with us, then we don't worry, we don't have fear, we have an inner spiritual confidence that radiates to all. In James 3, verse 13, it says this, Are there those among you who are truly wise and understanding? Then they should show it by living right and doing good things with a gentleness that comes from wisdom. A gentleness that comes from wisdom. When you know that you know that you know that God is with you every moment of every day, no matter where you find yourself, what circumstance, what mountain faces you, then you're a changed person. There's an old saying that is both familiar and it is true. Actions speak louder than words. So we should always make sure that our own actions reflect our faith and reflect the positive changes that God can make in the lives of those that follow God. You're following God. So one of the big things is to exhibit that to yourself when you look into the mirror and when you look into your own thinking and even your own memory and to exhibit that to others. The Creator calls upon each of us to act in accordance with God's will and respect all of God's commandments. It's never enough to simply hear God's instructions. No, it's not. We must follow God's instructions. And then, it's never enough to wait idly by. A lot of people do that. They just sit and they wait for God to do something. No, it is not up to us to wait idly by for God or for others to do the work. It's for us, in faith, in courage, to stand up and say, yes, pick me. I'm ready to do the work. And we must act. Doing God's work is a responsibility of each one of us. And it is something that when we do it, we're rewarded in countless ways, in ways beyond even our wildest imagination. God promises to reward our efforts with a bountiful harvest. And that harvest is something to partake of. And I wish that for you today. When you act, encourage. God bless you.